Hi there, this is MediP. You are looking at the HTC Desire um, C. Um, that's just me and my girlfriend. It's a great looking phone. Um, it works amazingly well. It's got Android 4.0, 600, mega, 600 megahertz processor. Um, let me just see if we can focus that any more. There you go, we are focused in. Using the Logitech Quick Cam Pro 9000 to record this with a USB Logitech microphone. Um, so, 600 megahertz processor, 512 meg of RAM, and also Android 4.0. I wish it would get upgraded to Android 4.1. I'm not 100% sure. It's a great little device, this, actually. It's a little phone. It's supposed to have all this Beats audio, so it's got your speaker. So it's got a nice speaker grill at the top. If I just... So there, you got your... At the top, you've got a nice, nice little speaker grill up at the top. It's a nice little phone. Um, I, I enjoy it. Um, I've got the aluminium HTC theme, well, skin. Um, so this is all the apps. Um, so if I go into settings, all the way to the bottom about mm, hardware. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm not well, but I wanted to make this video. Bluetooth 4.0. Don't know what that does. Um, the Wi-Fi BG and N. It, the Wi-Fi is turned off at the minute because I just generally use my mobile internet. 5 megapixel camera. I've seen somebody on um, the internet make a review saying it had an autofocus camera. The camera is a fixed focused camera, which is kind of a bummer. It's got a 600 megahertz Snapdragon process or something like that. It's a nice little device. Software information. There's all you need to know. 4.0 cents. Android 4.0.3. What I love is software updates. Click that and you can search. So you can search automatically for software updates. <coughs> it runs Android 4.0 very well. Um, I use it for Facebook, emails, um, phone calls and that kind of stuff. Um, I watch YouTube videos on it, record videos, so YouTube plays really, really well. And the speaker on the back isn't the best. It's supposed to have all its, let me lock the screen a minute, it's supposed to have all its Beats audio, because you'll see, and it gets greasy. And I've ordered a blue case for it, it gets Beats audio. Apparently the screen for this is £160, and I paid £130 on the free network from Carfum Warehouse. I am trying to get the back cover off, but it's going to be difficult. Uh, it is quite a difficult back cover to get off. Um, so, it's. Oh, sorry for knocking the camera, I apologise. So, it is, um, as you can see, um, red for the Beats Audio kind of stuff, and it's a nice Beats Audio. Um, it's got Beats Audio technology on it, so you got. Oh, I think it's up to a 32 gig memory card. The same battery as the HTC Wildfire S. I was thinking of getting this, or the Wildfire S. The speaker is there. Be careful not to break it. Yeah. Um, the grill doesn't look big enough for the speaker to let enough um, sound out. But that looks quite a big speaker. So it's a nice phone. You get your 3.5mm jack at the top. And these pins here is your near field technology. As you can see, you've got near field technology. And if you're buying the, like credit cards, you can use this as a credit card and buy your stuff like scan it on the machine just place your phone to the machine and there's the battery I love the battery the only thing I, which I would like about the battery is um, when it's full it should the bubbles should go up and down but when it's um, charging going up and down up and down the bubbles change so to view different to get into different applications here what you do is you film the camera you slide the camera into the circle I love the sense so the camera's going to load up and it's a fast camera but a fixed focus lens which really puts me off if it was auto focus then I would be like amazed with it and I've just um, so yeah this is a uh, just random videos and I can click that it'll play the video really good so I'm getting messages left right and centre but there's no audio in this video but this is a video quality and I've got it on high quality there. So yeah, absolutely great.
and plays videos well off YouTube and home getting lots of messages come through um, but yeah it's really good so check speed <coughs> excuse me I'm not feeling too well but I wanted to show off my phone um, it's a great phone for what it is so testing out my mobile network on H not 3G so if it was I think this phone is capable of 7.2 HSDPA and HSUPA as well um, it's quad band um, GSM GSM quad band so that's what it is make sure I get it there we go it's, it's really a great little phone I love it to bits so it works amazing and I, I wish it did have a faster CPU there's a game I've not tried which I actually want to try called Airport City if um, I don't know if that will work Airport City I could not be bothered actually t type, typing that in so I lift the phone up a little bit to not cover the microphone on the bottom um, it's got no noise cancellation but when you plug your headphones in it says beat charger at the top comes up when you're listening to music got a built in FM radio which I never use I use um, internet radio apps like Capital Capital Manchester and stuff like that so it's a really lovely phone so it's got these buttons don't light up which is a bummer on HTC Sensation these buttons are red which would have been nicer on this phone um, the Beats are Joey doesn't really make a difference because when you turn the sound announcer on are off it makes no difference you can't tell if it's working or not um, to the untrained ear you would not to a standard person who's not done a music course and not train train their ears to listen to different sounds and stuff they won't notice a difference I can notice it a little bit but it the speaker is kind of not as good as the Samsung Galaxy S3 and um, there's a lot H HTC must have bought um, must have paid so much to use the the Beat Audio logo and that it's just a logo really. The technology on board doesn't really do much satisfaction. I'd rather have the Samsung Galaxy S3 because that's a, I, um, I couldn't afford it. This um, I want to look on eBay how much a screen actually is for this device. But downloading apps is pretty straightforward. Um, yeah, just my girlfriend now messaging me so. Downloading apps is really easy. Going to the Play Store and you can get different apps and games. Um, it's, it's really fast. If you press this little button here, this one here, press that, it'll mm, a, it'll bring up your recent apps. So you can just swipe to close, which is what I love. <coughs> so to close everything down to, to speed up your phone, because you've opened that many apps in the background, it's really good at multitasking. Um, the only thing is um like the Samsung Galaxy S has a little video when you're watching um when you're watching a video you can watch it in a little little pop up screen while you're texting or something. I would love to be able to fact I would love to be able to with the YouTube app to be able to listen to it in the background. If you've got a music track playing off YouTube, I'd love to be able to minimize it and do me other multitasking stuff while it, the the video's playing in the background like you can on a computer. Because you just minimise the tab and then um, it still plays. But at the minute it's going pretty slow. Because I'm downloading something and the quality of the network around my area isn't really the best with the free network. And now it's lagging out. So I've got a favourites thing which I never use. I might get rid of it. Um, but I've got Google Chrome which is great. The camera um, is 6 by 480 video and a 5 megapixel resolution. So it's really snappy at taking pictures it, so if you put low light on um, press the A at the top and you might not be able to see it says A there at the top press that and then click on low light the low light works pretty well snap because there's no auto focus it takes picture a lot quicker um, if it had auto focus it would take pictures a few milliseconds slower I love this app this is your weather app pretty brilliant so yeah so at the top you got your standard lock button 
your headphones, no noise comes from the microphone, um, nothing on this side and buttons it. Um, you got your micro, uh, micro, micro USB charger. So yeah, that's really it. I'm gonna disappear now. But um, great, great little phone, and I just thought I'd show it off in all its glory and go through all the, show you the settings and that. And it's a really nice phone. So thank you for watching and peace out.